Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Pro Media back with another Dokkan Battle video. And today, I want to talk about global top grossing rewards. And I know some of you guys are thinking right now, but Tiger, you literally made a video about this topic a couple days ago, and then we got our top grossing rewards that night after the video came out, so what more is there to talk about? But the exciting thing is that there actually is a lot more to talk about because since we got those rewards like two to three days ago, the 100 stones, plus a bunch of other good stuff, a bunch of other new regions have now hit top grossing for the first time uh, in either the Google Play Store or the iOS App Store. So basically what I'm saying is that there is a very reasonable chance that we are gonna get a second set of top grossing rewards on global with more stones and possibly tickets this time. I think actually tickets are guaranteed since the first time we didn't get tickets. And uh, so that's definitely something worth getting hyped about. And in this video, I just wanted to quickly talk about and uh, well, talk about the potential rewards we can get and also give you guys an update on which regions have hit top grossing once again. So just like last time, we got a Reddit user here by the name of uh, Beal Roos. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. So if I say it wrong, I apologize, but Beal Roos did give us a quick update with all the new regions that have hit top grossing ever since um, we got our top grossing rewards a couple days ago. And while I don't know exactly when it's gonna happen, um, I think it's very reasonable for us to expect that at some point next week, you know, between probably Monday to Friday. Now, like I said, I don't know for sure. I don't work for Bandai, so um, <laughs> you know, don't expect like an exact time or. An exact date or anything like that but i think sometime next week we should be getting a second set of top grossing rewards for all of these new regions or not even new regions but for a lot of these like a lot of these places actually hit top grossing in one of these stores but now they hit top grossing in the other store too so maybe last time they hit top grossing for ios but now they also hit top grossing for android and uh, vice versa as well so Here's the update guys, let me go down uh, through the list real quick and of course thank you to Bielrus once again for providing us with this update. So the first thing is Hong Kong and they hit top grossing first place in the Play Store this time. Last time I believe it was the iOS store, the App Store. And we also have Italy who which is first place in the Play Store as well. Uh, Portugal hit first place in the Play Store, Spain hit first place in the Play Store. Puerto Rico hit first place in the Play Store. Luxembourg hit um, first place in the iOS Store. We got the Netherlands, which hit first place in the Play Store. And also Canada, my country. Now, unfortunately, I can't take credit for any of this because I actually don't play or don't have any iOS devices. So uh, this time around, you don't have to thank me for this. Last time when we hit top grossing in the Android Store, I was like, you're welcome, because you know I spent like 100 plus dollars for that. So I contributed towards that, but not 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 for the iOS store, which it's fine, it's fine. And uh, it says Canada for a brief time. Now, if you guys go, go back right now and check uh, all these stores, if you feel like it, uh, some of them might not be number one anymore, or we might not be number one in those stores anymore, but it doesn't matter because as long as at some point we hit top grossing in one of those stores, it will count towards the final count or the uh, final total for top grossing rewards. So we don't have to worry if like, you know, Canada says for a brief time. So maybe Canada right now is number two or number three in the iOS store, in the app store, but that doesn't really matter. As long as we hit it at some point, it, it does count. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight so far regions that have hit top grossing since we got our 100 stones and some other stuff. And um, you know, this was actually posted 16 hours ago, so I'm actually a little bit late, so. If you think about it, possibly some even like even more regions since then have hit top grossing too. So maybe we're at nine, maybe at ten, which is basically what we had for the previous top grossing board, like literally two to three days ago. And uh, the list is still you know piling up; it's still increasing. So um, I definitely, definitely, definitely expect some pretty good rewards for us global players coming soon. Uh, as part of this uh, set two or second set of top grossing rewards for part one of the four year anniversary. And as far as the rewards go, I, I can't say for sure. I don't, I definitely don't expect the 100 stones once again because I think that was a one time thing. Now it could happen, maybe, maybe, maybe if they're feeling very, very generous, they'll give us 100 stones again. But I think what's more likely is that um, instead of giving like 100 stones, they'll offset some of those stones with tickets instead, which I actually personally don't mind because there's still 
uh, summons for potential LRs, and the featured units on the ticket banner are pretty good too, so I'm personally expecting something like 30 to 50 Dragon Stones as part of the second set of rewards, but also on top of that something like 30 tickets, possibly up to 50 tickets, but I think 30 is a little bit more reasonable. And uh, for those of you that were expecting tickets for the last one, I apologize. Um, I think actually for JP, they got the 100 stones and tickets separately as part of different rewards, so they didn't get it all at the same time. I know last time I said, oh, we're probably going to get some tickets on top of the 100 stones, so I was wrong about that. I apologize. I can be wrong sometimes, so I will admit that. But this time around, I, I am very, very like 90% certain that we will get tickets on top of the stones. So like I said, somewhere between 30 to 50 stones, as well as uh, possibly 30 or so tickets, and uh, some other you know stuff they generally give like, I don't know, maybe ties, maybe some Hercule statues, maybe some orbs, all that good stuff. But I think the stones and tickets are for sure. And once again, not exactly certain when that's gonna happen, but since we had so many new regions, hit top grossing on the other store um, you know like, like if it was iOS last time it's Android this time if it was Android last time then it's iOS this time and also some new ones like the Netherlands and Luxembourg that were even part of that list before so uh, I definitely expect some good stuff and I don't know exactly when that's gonna happen but I expect sometime next week between Monday to Friday at reset and uh, I guess <laughs> get hyped about that guys because uh, more free summons more free to well, I mean, free tickets on top of no free tickets last time. You know what I'm trying to say. I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit like, my, my thoughts are a little bit jumbled right now, but I hope that the general meaning makes a lot of sense. I hope I've conveyed <laughs> what I'm trying to say in an effective way. And I uh, hope you guys are excited. So that's all I got to you know, talk about in today's video. That's the update I want to give you guys as far as the top grossing situation goes. And uh, do expect a second set of top grossing rewards very soon. Not 100% sure it's going to happen. Like I said, I don't know what Bandai is ever going to do, but I think it's very, very reasonable for us to expect it. And uh, I think there's a very, very good chance it's going to happen. So um, stay tuned, guys. Obviously, when it does drop, you guys will know it's going to be in the news. You're going to find rewards in your box. And uh, I just wanted to give you guys a little update before that actually happens. So that's going to do it for today's video, guys. Let me know in the comments down below what kind of rewards you personally expect. Do you agree with me in terms of 30 to 50 stones as well as around 30 tickets? Or do you think it's going to be something else? Do you think we're going to get 100 stones again? Do you think we're not going to get tickets still? Do you think we're going to get uh, like 50 tickets and less stones? Or some other combination of the two? Let me know in the comments down below. I would love to see your opinions. And that's all I got to say, guys. Hopefully, you enjoyed today's video. And as always, if you guys liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel and you like what you see then definitely hit that big red subscribe button join the tiger squad now and while you're at it hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and that's all i gotta say guys thank you so much for watching today and i will see you in the next video have a fantastic day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out